at 6. Good evening, everybody. A new poll is out today, and it shows a majority of New Yorkers support making recreational marijuana legal. This is legalization is inching forward. If that happens, it looks like counties will get to choose whether it remains illegal within their borders. Kayla Green tells us now where Monroe County stands. Monroe County Executive Cheryl Donolfo wouldn't say if she'd opt Monroe County out of legalizing recreational marijuana if it passes in the state budget. She also tells us it could end up being up to towns or cities instead of counties. If it does pass, she says she hopes the taxing stream money goes to the right places. I would really be sorely disappointed if that revenue is used for downstate purposes like MTA and not addressing the potential societal ills that will come out of legalization of recreational marijuana. Those needs uh, are real and they need to be met regardless of who opts out or who does not. She says some of those potential issues could be public safety related. Donolfo says she's spoken to law enforcement, medical professionals, and business professionals to hear their concerns. She says she urges Cuomo to step back and make sure all pieces are in place. The issue is much more complex than a yes or no. Uh, lots of issues to consider, and I want to make sure that as a county and as a state that we are prepared to answer those questions fully before legalization of recreational marijuana goes forward. Rockland and Putnam are two of the counties saying they're leaning towards opting out if the decision does end up at their discretion. Monroe County Clerk Adam Bello, who's running against Dinolfo for county executive this fall, said, said this in a statement. Opting out would not prevent residents from possessing and using marijuana locally, and it would only serve to cut the county off from critical tax revenues that could be used to address any of the public health and public safety ramifications of legalization. Adam, Maureen? All right, already a political issue. Thank you, Kayla. The state budget is due by April 1st. It is still not certain whether marijuana legislation will be included in the budget.